What's going on YouTube? It's Chili Powder, and today I'm bringing you my CSR 18 and team doubles gameplay. Alright, so I'm playing with Nano Explode, my actual team doubles partner, and uh, we went in and we knocked out a couple more games, so um, got some more footage for you guys, and we'll just talk about the gameplay because I don't know what else to talk about right now. Um, nothing really big going on. Uh, I don't know what that guy was thinking. He had me because I was playing dumb. Um, I make quite a few dumb plays in here, but then I make some, like, average ones. I wasn't too scared of these guys. They were rocking, like, a 1.4 to 1.3. Alright, right here, my mic wasn't plugged in yet, so I just stopped. And, uh, as soon as I came back, I tried to ninja this guy, but it didn't work out. Anyway, so... Uh, I step out green window. He knew to stay, like, green side where I would spawn or pull back away from them so we got a nice team shot on that guy um, he puts two shots towards him just to get his attention then I'll step out I know it's safe to step out because he's not looking at me anymore um, if I had shot that guy he would have died um, but I decided to start throwing grenades because I thought I was just going to sit behind the pillar he was smart to back down um, punch shoot I don't know what he was thinking again alright so I'm just going to point out some like, some team tactics that we use. Right here I got shot once, um, so I told him to put two shots on because I thought he was going to push me. And if he had, I would have been a shot ahead, so I would have challenged it and actually won it. Right there, I swear I picked up the sticky debt, but I didn't. Um, right here, this is a pretty easy play. This guy runs because he's like one shot. So it leaves a two-on-one situation with both of us full health. So we get the easy cleanup. I'm still full health, so I'm definitely going to challenge this guy. And I just realized right there, I was like, I don't have my sticky debt. So I push back, I see he spawned on window, so I'm going to go ahead and grab it anyways, because sticky debt close range is uh, pretty hard to deal with. Um, that stick right there where I actually stuck him up, one, one time uh, when the game first came out, uh, I was 1v1ing my brother and I had stuck him and I was treating him like my dog. Like as soon as you stick someone you can just be like, sit, sit boy, or something, something stupid, I don't know. You own them after that, so, you know. Alright, um, let's get back to the gameplay. As you can see we're always dissecting the map in halves, uh, he's, I'm gonna sit ring three, um, he's ring, he's ring three with me right now actually, that's weird. Uh, so I jump off. Oh, see, I did realize in game. Normally we don't do that. It's, it's not a good idea to have two people ring three. Um, so he called out red main. So I just made this guy one shot. Knew he wasn't gonna challenge. So I started looking over at a uh, red main. And so my partner's um, on green flat. So I'm gonna jump up, ring three, and he pushed, which is a nice push because uh, they're both weak. He lived easily. Uh, and see, now look, we rotated together. He calls out, I'm pushing blue. So I rotated around and looked like I, I went ring three blue side, and we started circling around, looking at the exact same stuff. Um, I think it was Walshy who said it, but it could have been Gandhi. Uh, so don't kill me if I'm wrong. I know it's one of those two. But uh, one of them said, uh, back in their setup for Narrows, they are like, well, how was your, like, start off at Narrows, you know? And, like, how do you, like, promote uh, teamwork and whatnot? Uh, and I believe it was Walshy, but Walshy said uh, that it wasn't so much, like, teamwork and, like, knowing where callouts and stuff are or, like, where everything's at. Uh, on Narrows, he said he, uh, it was more of them just looking at the same things and being on the same page already, like... They would push top mid together, and that was their strategy, to push top mid so they would see the same thing, so they would be on the same page. And so I took that to heart, and I uh, I really try to look at the same things my teammates are doing, just, like, being positionally correct, of course. Like, see, uh, he's ring three, and he's telling me he's looking red. Um, I actually saw him green pillars. I actually got a call out green pillars, and I was confused right there for a second because he got one guy by himself so but I took it to heart as in like I'm trying to push like and look at the same things that my partners are it actually helps quite a bit I, uh, if you're walking down a street 
like a like a long haul or like a on a drift the hallways you see the same guys so you know if you're both looking at the same guys you're just going to naturally team shot because you're not going to not shoot that guy and that's what his point was um if you're looking at the same thing you're going to naturally shoot at the same guy and naturally get that team shot going so that's what we try to do um that's what i try to do that's an awesome tip i uh, i hope i made sense enough for you guys to like understand and take away from that but like so i'm normally the one that does that but sometimes he'll do it or like i'll dictate him to look a certain way but he'll go um i'm pushing gold street from green sticks or something so i'll start like making my way to look at the same things he is so he doesn't even have to call out you know i can i'm just there already i already know all right so that's the game i'm chili powder guys look at this ninja he tries to do and then i ninja him back like subscribe i'm out